What's up guys? All right, another gear breakdown. I'm gonna con continue to do gear breakdowns because man, it's a big help when you got some knowledge when you're going to buy something, especially with the price of stuff these days and things just get out of hand. Um, and I just learned from experience where you'll be like, man, I'd like to have that. And you buy it and you get it and you're like, hmm, probably shouldn't have bought that. I've done that a lot. So uh, the stuff that I'm going over is stuff that I have been using. And it, if it stays in my kit, I'm going to break it down because I think it's a, it's a big help. If it doesn't stay in my kit, I don't even worry talking about it just because it's like, why am I going to, why am I going to talk something up that I'm not, I'm not actually using? So, um, this one was a big deal for me and, uh, just, I'll just quick, quick it real quick. It's the grail. It's the water bottle, uh, uh, the purifier in one. Now, I have an MSR pump, I have aqua tabs, I have a Steri pen, uh, I have water bags, you know, I have all that stuff. If I'm going into timber, or I'm going in the back country, and I'm staying for days, I'm going to take that stuff. If I'm going out for just a couple days, and I have a water access, and I've learned this the hard way just recently, and I'll get into that here in a minute. I'm taking this. Um, so, essentially this, you don't need to bring that stuff because this is gonna purify your water, fill it up, it's a geopress system. So, this comes out. You have a filter there, okay? You fill this up, it has a fill line on it. Once you fill it up, you sit this down in here. You have a, your cap here has an orange and a green. You crack that back to green, like so. Put some pressure on that bad boy. And you just geopress that down. And as you're geopressing that down, the water is gonna push up through this filter system. It's gonna clean everything, and then it's gonna hold up in this reservoir right there. So, couple things. <laughs> First thing is, you don't want, you want to try to find cleaner water. So, if you can have access to um, a stream where water's running and it's cleaning itself, the sediment off the rocks, uh, that'll be your best bet. Um, but you can, you know, you can skim the top of a, of a, of a still, uh, still uh, water area and, and it'll be okay. Um, I've done that. Uh, even with the sediment in it, it didn't make a big a big deal. They just if you, the dirty obviously the dirtier the water, the harder it's going to be on the filter itself. And you can clean these filters. Um, there's a process behind it where you take it off, you run water the opposite way, pushes the sediment out, put the filter back on, and you can reuse it. Um, it does a it does a pile of water before you have to change that cartridge out. But I'm notorious for running out of water. Notorious. I do it all the freaking time. I don't like a camel back, um, even though I brought one with me today because I'm going to run the mountain. Uh, I brought a camel back because it's going to be hot. Um, and I'm trying to get used to at least using one when I'm working out or, or running or trail running so I have water and I can stay hydrated. But like when I'm hunting and I'm hiking and stuff, I always run out of water. And then take it from me because I've located water on the maps before. I get into the mountain. I go to that source on the pin that I dropped. And the creek bed's dry. Uh, so then I'm out of water. I'm screwed. I mean, not even a month ago, it pulled me off the mountain because I ran out of water and I couldn't find any water. I had to, I had to pop smoke and pull, and pull out. So this thing right here is great because you have everything in one system. Uh, so you can always have clean water. I mean, you don't want to be, you don't want to get Giardia. I can tell you that uh, for a fact. Um, and you, I mean, obviously you don't want to, just don't want to be drinking bacteria and stuff like that. But it's nice to, to dumb everything down to one system rather than having a, a pump, um, pumping water or running aqua tabs. Um, to me, if you have a water bladder and aqua tabs, it'll be good if you're camping because you can fill that up and drop water tabs in it, let that hang and purify. Um, 
so you have water at your base camp. But if you're not, if you're just going out for the day, um, and maybe even overnight, two nights, this is really all you're going to need if you have a water source to where you can get water. I mean, this is a, this is a big deal. Uh, it is to me anyway, uh, which is why I'm breaking it down because this will essentially be the water bottle that I take throughout the hunting season, um, like days like today where um, I'm, I'm spending the day in the mountain, but I'm coming out. Um, but definitely hunting, you know, in the hills and the mountains and stuff like that, where you're around these, uh, these creeks and stuff like that. If you have this, you know, you always be able to keep, keep, you know, hydrated because there's nothing worse than 12 hours in the woods and you got one bottle of water and that's it, you know, you're kind of screwed. Um, at least I am anyway. If I'm not drinking, you know, at least <clears throat> six Nalgene's a day, I'm something's wrong with me. Um, but this is going to replace my Nalgene essentially just so I can always uh, purify my water um, regardless of the situation. So I think this is a good investment to make. Um, like I said, it's the Grail. As usual, I'll put it in the description below. Uh, if you have any questions about it, it's a simple system, guys. It's a GeoPress system. Fill it, press it, drink it. You're good. I mean, there's... There's nothing else you can do. I will say the first couple times, and I don't know if it's just because it's a new filter, it's got a weird taste. Uh, then after about the third time, you really can't tell. And it might just be the, it's a new filter, uh, and that might be the, the case. Or I just got weird taste buds, I don't know. But uh, yeah, I think this is killer. Um, I think this is a good thing to keep, uh, keep on you at all times. Um, <clears throat> you know, uh, I actually have a, a buddy of mine, he bought, uh, I think he bought like three of these and he keeps like one in his truck, keeps one in his pack. And I don't know what he does with the other one. It's probably not my business, but, um, yeah, the grail, it's a good, uh, it's a good buy. Um, so if you have any questions, feel free to ask, uh, but it's pretty self-explanatory and, um, I think they're like a hundred bucks, which you're, it's really not a bad price for everything that it does. So, uh, check them out. Grail.com. I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna get up on this mountain and, uh, do a little bit of scouting and want to run this bad boy. But uh, I'll see y'all soon. I'm out.